I know there have been a lot of people that are saying that oh it was just come you know in time and then boys are usually late talkers and so They call me sassy when I'm strolling down the street. They call me classy when I'm serving just the best. I can be deadly when I find somebody lovely. Right, we're here for Colton's um, speech therapy. Colton, are you ready to see Miss Brittany? No, he doesn't care. Are you ready for your sucker? <laughs> we are at our favorite Asian buffet um, near his physical, oh not physical, speech therapy um, office. <laughs> Do you want to tell our friends what happened to the speech therapy today? Do you want to tell our friends? Hmm? Yeah. Oh, here. First time talaga siyang nagtantrum ng ganun dun sa therapy um, office. Super, nasa lobby pa lang kami, umiiyak na siya. Like super iyak na siya. Tapos yung ibang mga parents na nandun na uh, just waiting for uh, their time or their turn sa therapy. As in, they were like all looking at me like, oh my gosh, like you don't know how to parent your kid or something like that. Like they had those stares na, <sighs> it was just, I yeah, I know. Ikaw pinag namin. <laughs> but it was really, really bad. <laughs> it was really bad. And I feel sorry for him that I had to wake him up, you know, because normally he would nap for two to three hours. Kanina, he only napped for an hour and a half, and then I had to wake him up. There is only one of you, only one of me. No, no, no. There's a million of those who won't let us be. <laughs> They're not gonna, not gonna see me bleed Cause baby, I got you, 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 you I've been beaten to the ground, dragged across the dirt I've been scared to live to some people never learn But they're not gonna, not gonna watch me burn Cause baby, I got you, 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 you It's been a bit and if you can tell it's still very, very bright outside, so parang hindi siya seven o'clock ng gabi. But anyways, Colton's already sleeping, and I have our laundry here. Having a little bit of a chit chat with you guys uh, while I'm folding laundry. Parang naman, um, you know, hitting two birds with one stone. And since this day is all about Colton's speech therapy, I am going to, siguro for those people na hindi um hindi uh aware or we're not or we're not able to watch my video informing you guys that we are going to put um colton to speech therapy because at two years old wala pa siyang any words and supposedly at that age meron ng at least 50 words na uh Nasasabi yung bata, that's like the normal range. And with him, as in zero talaga. As in, mama, dada, and covered naman ng insurance yung mga sessions niya. Sa lahat ng therapies niya, um, I was like, why not? A little bit of extra push. And at the same time, I'm learning myself because kinakausap ko yung mga therapist. And I ask questions all the time. And they also give me tips. But since we started the speech therapy, yun na nga, he was babbling more. And you can recognize more sounds. He's been imitating more. And you know, he's been doing the ba. He, he's like trying. And now he's been like trying to like talk to us. Talk to us. Kahit na hindi siya. Hindi mo maintindihan yung sinasabi niya. But then to him, it's like he's talking to us. But it's just he's a language na alam niya. But not us, if that make, makes sense. Which is kind of cute and funny, you know, if you... If you hear him i know there have been a lot of people that are saying that oh it was just come you know in time and then boys are usually late talkers and stuff like that and honestly i don't know like that might be true but you instinct instinct as a mother is telling me otherwise like it's like my heart is telling me that just 
get help for him. The session namin, she um, she was asking about the updates, and then I was telling her about him, um, you know, saying ba, and then signing the more when he wants milk, and then she mentioned about AAC device. And what AAC device is, it's called, I think it's called augmentative and alternative communication device. So this is like a device na um, nonverbal kiddos use so that they can communicate to us by using, you know, like pictures on the device. I mean, my device is a tablet or laptop. For example, if they want bread, then they will press the picture bread and then it will also say bread and so that way for us it's easy to understand what they really want um so i already know what an aac device is before she even uh, mentioned it to me because i've been i've been researching the heck out of this believe me guys i've been researching the heck out of this and and that's you know, like speech therapy, nonverbal at, at his age. I am not um, against, you know, using an AAC device like in the near future if needed, talaga. You know, but hopefully, but you know, really my hope is na we won't need it because he will start talking na. You know what I mean? That's my ultimate goal, ultimate dream for my son. That's the reason why I put him on, or we put him on speech therapy anyways, is to help him talk. That's what I'm trying to do with Colton. The earlier that we can get him professional help and the better for him. And I guess that would also give a better chance for him to really have an improvement. And I feel so blessed and grateful that we have that opportunity dito sa America na we have the technology, we have the studies, and also the ability, because out of the insurances and stuff like that, to get services for our for our kids, you know, for for things like this. Now, siguro when siguro when we are in the Philippines, I'm, yes, you can get services like this, but I don't think coverage in among insurance. So you really have to pay out of pocket all the time for any therapy session that you get there. basically what i'm trying to say is i'm just taking advantage of what we have here say us um especially when it comes to the improvement or better health better life na family ko i'll i'll take it all the time so i don't care if i need to go to therapy every single day with my kid basta i know na he's gaining you know, um, he's getting help and I know that he is improving with whatever help that he gets. I'm all for it. So that's why I have been learning how to, not learning, but I have been um, really motivated to get my driver's license. So that way, you know, um, it would just be easier for her family because Chris is the one really working to have an income for the family so we could pay our bills and stuff like that. And... Um, so it's really hard na I don't drive, I don't have a driver's license yet and then I have to drag him all the time for whenever we have to go to therapies. I say I know that he wants to, to work so you know he can provide for us. That's why I'm like I'm gonna step it up and I'm going to get my driver's license soon. So I've been um, literally driving around with Chris right now and I know na I, I mentioned before na nag I um, signed up for more driving lessons, but that won't come. That won't be. Um, that won't come until the 21st of July. So ano pa lang ayon? July 5. So my dalawang two weeks pa ako before my driving lessons. So while we're waiting, um, we decided that we just get on with it and. <laughs> I go behind the wheels again and start driving. So Yon, thank you so much po, for watching this vlog and I will see you again tomorrow. My physical therapy is equal to and so we, I will take you with us. Thank you and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>